I am very happy for people that got a, several or a couple Bitcoins or whatever, or even one Bitcoin, half a Bitcoin, and are holding on to it today. I'm very happy for those people. Yeah. Like, that's amazing. I'm not knocking, like, anybody that's making money in crypto if you're doing it the right way um, and if you're not doing it off hype. Like, do not watch a random video or even a Gary V video, all right? Please. And just be like, man, I need to get my wallet out. And like, okay, I need to, I need to get into Ethereum because Gary V said, you know, May fifteenth or whatever was it, May fifth or whatever. I, I don't, I just need to get in. I need to get in the market. Don't do that. Like, I just do things that you understand. And I think to your to your point earlier, right? In business, no matter what business you're in, you always have a funnel, right? There's a funnel, right? So people come from, you know your marketing, your advertising, whatever you put out there um, or whatever you do to be known. Uh, for me, it's like YouTube, right? So I'm all over YouTube and then people come and they, you know, they join my Facebook group and things like that um, and, and stuff. And then, and then I, I work with them. And if you've got that funnel, you can tweak it, like you said. And we're both control freaks and we know how to do that. And savvy business people know how to do that stuff. But like, like you said, on crypto, you're like, what do you... What are you gonna do? It's a lottery ticket, man. Like it's like, dude, you talk about Dogecoin and how it's a joke coin all day long, named after like a or or created after like a dog. Yeah, whatever. Pretty sure it was. Yeah, yeah. it's like it's a dog. It's a certain type of dog. It's a I forget what it is. Um, but like you could talk about how funny that is all day long and like everything, but I don't know if Elon Musk is is actually like like there's these big trades like you know i'll see on tiktok somebody like will like unveil like the trade you know you can actually look up people that have made big pushes in the market yes. yeah and like people see elon musk dumping and they're, they're always like they see where he's pushing in money or taking he moves the market you for know sure I mean? and he can do that with yeah when you're a billionaire you can that's what you that do for sure so I'm sure he's playing around with it. I'm sure he's doing stuff to make something happen on his birthday. Right. Um, whether it goes to a dollar or not, I hope it does for all you holders. Right. Um, but at, at the end of the day, like, listen, like, it's, it is a joke coin. And just for that fact alone, I would pull a Mr. Wonderful and just say, like, I'm out, you know? Right. You know? Like, yeah. it, because it, it's just like, you know, because of that, yeah. I'm not, you know, it's, there's a point where it just doesn't get funny anymore. <laughs> right. Yeah. Like, I mean, if I were to look back at myself when I was first starting businesses, like what, 2011, 2012, and all I had was $1,000 in the bank. And what would I tell myself now or you know, now back then? Definitely would have still like, yes, it's easy to be like, yeah, go crypto because those things are going to be. $60,000 a pop, but not knowing exactly what would have happened. It's just like, I wouldn't recommend someone to do something that again, something that they don't know and something they can't control. Like as far as like all my time and effort, um, learning about crypto could have been talking about marketing could have, you know, I could talk about Facebook ads. I could learn more about how to market and you create YouTube content and start a business, start a coaching business, do e-commerce. Like, right. Those are like, I think things that I learned and I'm so glad I invested in right. to learn. So now that I could speak off the cuff with it, like right. I know it like the back of my hand right. where like, okay, so now say for the last 10 years, you were all about Bitcoin and sure. Like you might, you might've, if, if maybe you were even day trading, yeah. But like maybe you made a good hundred thousand or so on that. Mm. But like at the end of the day, it's like if if that ever went away or like now it's reached a point where it's only like ten percent gains a year. Like yeah. What did you really gain from learning that much about it? And maybe I'm being naive here. Maybe no, I'm no, like, I think you're being like very I, direct and I don't, sober yeah. about it. Like um like it, it's a sobering concept, I think, for a lot of people to be like, listen, like Here's the thing, business skills, business concepts, um, you know, about growing an entity, growing a program, growing a mentorship, like, you know, that I have growing a consulting, uh, uh, a consulting process that you have for students, that kind of thing is scalable, right? Like super scalable, super malleable, 
um, in the fact that you can change the way you do it and add to it, extract from it, like just make it something super cool. And that's like what you and I are like hyped on, right? That's our hype because that's real hype. You know, the hype, the, there isn't really hype. It's just excitement about real business stuff. 